Ladies and cheats. Today, I am testing out a subscriber's Girapur Ether Grid. Throne of the God Pharaohs Tap Man. Tap my man's fam's deck. Uh, I tried to make a Girapur Ether Grid deck once before and it fell flat on its balls. Um. Well, you get a turn two smugs. Hey, that's the beans, isn't it? Turn to smooths! Although I've got no way of crewing it, so the old double edged knob, but it'll be fine. It'll be fine! <sighs> now, let's think. How else does it. Yeah. So, Gear Up Her Ether Grid. BBD, it's the first time I'm playing the deck, so if I make any misplays, as always, eat shit. Um, hmm. Do I play this and then telling shit? I'm actually shitting on my ass. I mean, I'd rather get something resolved. Get something resolved and play some tap lands and scratch my balls. You never know. Well, I think there's a 0% chance that I can play an untapped creature. Unless it's a Bowmat courier. Nope, nope. Nope! Uh, hmm. Alright. Sky Sovereign, you're rude boys. But I got enough. I got enough big mans. So let's think. What does this do? Improvise. When enters the battlefield, create two one one fobby blops. That's not terrible. But I need Throne of the God Pharaoh. That's the whole point. That's all gear up her ether grid. Something like that. To start chipping away with the beats. So what do we got here? So if I play this guy, I get three energy and I can make a 1-1. One, one. Or if I do this, I can have a 1-1. One, one. Alright, I think I'll do this. I suppose I could have just played a Bowmat Courier, held Harness Lightning up for some spaghettis. But who, who can be sure about anything in life anymore? <laughs> the world is a bleak place, and it doesn't get any better when you're playing arty blaps. Well, it doesn't get any better if you're playing Magic Jewels. You know you're fucked up somewhere, if that's what you're doing with your balls. Alright, don't need two of those. Maybe I do need two of those, but I ain't thinking about it. Hmm, what do I need two of? I need this fucking throne of the shit. That's the point of the deck, you bellend. I think that's the biggest piece of shit when... It comes to Magic Arena's restrictions. It's that you get completely innocuous uh, rares and even mythics that you think I need four, uh, or they're just fucking useless. Like mainly, all right. What we're gonna do here? We're gonna crew this man. And I'm going to attack. And if he double blocks, I'll have to harness lightning one of those things. Weird that we would both be playing fringy dog shit decks. Mm. Uh, Alright, ether shits. Eat balls. That's one. That's two. Oh, what's he got? Spell Shrivs! Pretty good. <sighs> did I make a man at the end of turn? Possibly. We'll see what happens. That did wipe his entire board out, which is not bad. I think I could fight through a reality smasher. He ain't even got one, fam! He ain't even got no smash! Alright. Make a bollock. Play a Padims. Play a Padims. Hopefully he doesn't have another Willy Shriveler or something. Well, I got two Padims now, so. It'll be fine. Hmm. I've got no more energy, so eat my spaghetti. Plus, I got another three of those dudes. 
See, if I had found that fucking potato, I could be racking up the da extra damage. Yeah. So, Matherick Thopterist is just a five mana version and worse than this dude. Well, eh, maybe it's not. Maybe, maybe rice and peace. Oh, he's got the ramps and he's got a picture of Emrakul. Do you think his willy is getting hard on the prospect of casting the cozy bags? Cozzles, mukshmozzles. Still, he's only got one man ace. I think I draw an extra card off of that stupid thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Do I crew this for four? Crew it. I keep saying crew when it's just a, a, a shit. Or do I play this and run the risk of getting blown up? Yeah, eat my bollocks. It's four damage next turn and another four. If they're if they're not dead. Not actually playing that guy. Just in case just in case he's got the turbo sweeps. Let's see what colours are here. Mm. Alright. I suppose he could have what's the um Bollocks wave, shitbags wave, put all the weenies, but put everything back in your ass. Nope. Or maybe. No, but no deals. Come on, we gotta smash them. We gotta smash them this turn. Otherwise, we're getting our own balls exiled. Draw two. Padim's quite good. Just a couple of fucking useless bullshits. That's what you want. All right, I don't know if that was lethal damage or what, because I didn't do the mathematics, but... See, this is the problem. This is the thing, ladies and gentlemen. You build a deck under the proviso, it's going to be sexy Giripa Ether Grid slash Throne of the God Pharaoh beats. It's just staying at top the beats, because fucking Majiks won't let me play what I want. You stupid beach. All right, well, let's play another one anyway, because that's what today's all about, playing this stupid box. Alright, what have we got here? Whirler Bollock and Throne of the God Shits. Alright, I'm sure I'll draw some lands tomorrow. It'll be fine. Alright, so let's think. Let's think of the mana spaghetti. Maybe God Pharaoh's not what I want to play straight away. Mm hmm. So I could beep 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 beeps. Mm, okay. There's nothing else, and I'm okay for mana. So that's that's fine. I'll play Ether Sphere shit next turn, and then Whirler Virtuoso the turn after that with all of this, and then hopefully Wandering Bollocks. It's fine for the shits. Ah, all right, vehicles, vehicles. Let's see if I can hold my spaghetti long enough to actually not get my balls run over. All right, that's a good card. Mm -mm -mm. I don't think there's any point in giving that a smash in the ass because I'm gonna have to kill his vehicles. It's a shame this doesn't trigger on the end of your opponent's end step because crewing people means you still have to be completely on the attack or your balls are falling off. All right, now this guy might actually have to get blacked. We'll see. I'll decide tomorrow. I can take four for now if I'm gaining three. So there's no need to pull your pants down just yet. Mm. Alright, I can play the fumarole now. If the, I don't have any manies that I need to be wanking on. Let's see. D D D. Alright.
suppose I could block that. Give it lifesteal, as they say, in the, what do you call it, world? The world of Eternals. Oh, ladies and peeps, what day is today? The 28th of February. I feel like tonight is going to be a good night for the draw. Not the draw. Yeah, the Magiques. The Magiques. Uh, sealed. What the fuck am I saying? The Magique stream. That guy, he's going to give us no news. But it's going to be a worthwhile mushroom. That's what I think. Okay, so I'm taking nine. Yeah, but then he's out of he's out of spaghetti. I'm going to be able to kill whatever he wants. I'm going to gain three, and he's going to lose a lot. So I'm not shitting my pants. Hopefully, I can draw a padim or something that gives this an extra. Yeah. Alright, do I play this? Oh, keep that up. Nah, that's just, just not mana efficient. There's no mana efficiency in it, fam. Like I said, I ain't getting killed. I ain't getting killed by no biatch. Mm, Alright, I'm only crewing one. <laughs> the, the, uh... The temptation is to crew all your peeps to tap them all down, but I don't think that's needed. Don't think it's needed. Plus, I might get run over. You never know. This way, I can at least block four damage here, or even here, if he kills this somehow. Taking the damage. Big ball of McGee's, just like Negan says. Taking it like a champ! What could that mean? It could mean he goes for the Pompedos. But I got two blocks. Mm. Mm, I don't think that's... I don't think that's enough. I could just crew all my peeps with this and win, even if I don't inflict any damage. Alright, if he's got the pumps, I'm still winning. Easy. Easy as shitting your ass out. Alright. Let's hold our balls for a good match. But you sort of see how this is working. <sighs> yeah, Majik's Arena. Majik's Arena. I feel like if you don't have the beta and you th you think it looks childish or heartstone-y or just, you know, a little bit off-putting, I feel like if you play it long enough, i.e. a couple of weeks or even months, you're going to come around. You're going to come around to the animations... You're going to come around to the Planeswalkers speaking when they s scratch their asses. Turn to smugs. Turn to smugs. <laughs> but no turn four, no turn three crew at the moment. I do have a turn four for teams. Mm. All right, I think that's still the plate. Because I can harness lightning something next turn with the tap land. Then play Sulphur Falls. Have up a team. Crew the smugs. Kick some balls. Do the edits so that it looks like the guy is conceded when he's actually won. Because that's what's next on the old Dr. Bumcheek's channel. Ooh, that's definitely getting blapped. You could easily put in an argument that it's quite an innocuous card. But I play ramp too much. I know it's got the sexy, sexy legs. Full cost. It might be. It might do nothing, but if my one three gets blapped when I'm playing ramp, I throw my toys right out of the pram. Mm. 
All right, you're still ramping. I feel, I don't know if I can beat a full-on rampage. I'm so surprised that this version gets played more than any other, because I think it's the shits. So if this doesn't die or get bounced, I can draw two cards next turn. So what's actually getting flung in the bin? All right, made the decision easy. Although, why should we not draw another land for the rest of the time? Ether Sphere is getting played because it's more. Because vehicles can just win over this. Well, they're both good. That's why I didn't fling either of them away. Wheel Cease. Six manas. What has he got for his six? Nothing yet. That means everything in this hand must be seven mana or more. So. Could get my balls busted. Can I outstrip Doctor? I get to draw two. I always forget that with the Padims. Quite the good card. For five minutes, that was fifteen dollars. A foil one. Literally five minutes. Um. Hmm. I can do both. It's, it's fine. Keep that guy on the sidelines. So, what could get me a lot? What's the enchantment? The enchantment where flyers can't attack. That would be bad. Alright, Virtuoso, he's good, but Glimmer is bad. Strange that he's got two Westvale Abbeys, but no creatures. And it's a ramp deck. Okay. Fingers crossed he gets destroy target artifact and he hasn't realized they've all got hexproof. Hold your balls. Hold your ball beanies. Hold your rice and cakeinies. Come on. Ah, he knew. He knew. He's played the Majinks before. What a bitch. Ah, I'll get in the life over the loot, especially if I can keep doing all of this shit. Mm. All right, let's do this first. All right, I'll take them both. Mm. Ah, I'm not, I'm not doing that this time. I forgot. Yeah, that might come back and bite me on the spaghetti. <laughs> we'll see if it does. I could have just played that as a blocker for this. Instead, I'm taking six. That I probably didn't need to take. Never mind. Let's see, can I win next turn? Play this, my artifacts get haste. Play this. Eh, one, two, three. I can't, you know, I can't do no maths. Can't do no maths, I do no schmiths. <sighs> All right, if I don't die this turn, I do think I'm gonna win. Party Pete, come on Party Pete. I thought I would have thought a party beats man would know what he's doing. Hey, <laughs> he can't do nothing with it, son. But I think he did know. Unfortunately, that's why he got a uh, rogue refiner instead of the shits. He's too smart. What's the what's the ranks? Thirty six. Yeah, man, man, has got to know what hexproof symbol is. Ah, oh, man. Yeah, I think, ladies and gentlemen, today is going to be an interesting day for magics. Um. All right, so I need to win this turn, or he's going to Westvale me. Hmm. Now let's do the maths. Yeah, I think I I'm gonna win. Three, six, and that's another two. That's death. That's another one. 
That's another one or two. All right, I think I I think it's in the bag. All right, it's in the bag. Everybody, calm your spaghetti. Kind of want to play gear per ether grid, but that's not how I'm, how I'm winning. So it doesn't even matter. So crew, any crew, just fucking everything, really, just for extra damage. Yeah, he's figured out. He's brown breeds. See, you crew everybody. He takes the extra damage off the thing. That was lucky. I mean, he was on for the Westies. He was on for the Westles. Okay, let's play one more. One more, and then one game of something else, other deck, and then we'll call it the shits. <sighs> yeah, I, like I say, uh, this video is going up after the Magic Arena stream. Is he going to get someone in? Did he? I should speak of it in the past tense, considering I know the temporal fluctuations of Baby Jesus' bum cheeks. Is he going to phone Paulie Cheebs, who works downstairs, and say, come up and play? We can hope. Alright, I think that's okay. Who's going first? Me. So, no plays until four, but uh, hopefully I'll draw or something. I don't think he mulligan this hand. Yeah, that's all right. Which one is this? Kill a Thopter when it dies. Fair enough. So I got this on turn four for sh certain. It should be fine. Man, Magic Arena Draft. That's that's pretty much the only question left. How much does it cost? When can I do it? Mm, Sky Sovereign. Everyone loves the Sky Spaceships. Everyone loves Star Trek. Do you like Star Trek? I like Star Trek. I used to like it when I was little, and it's probably why I'm completely fascinated by the cold and the dark. Or there's some deep psychological issue that I've forgotten about. Mm, kind of need him to crew it up. Do I take a turn off? I think I do. I could just run this out, but that damage is happening, and I've got nothing good for this. So I think I'm just going to play Ether Bubs. Hold my ass. If he crews it, I'll blap it. If he doesn't crew it, then I can just draw some cards. That's the plan, anyway. Also, what's with two weird decks in a row? I thought it was black, white zombies. He's got red. For what? Nahiri and vehicles. This is strange. Also, excellent news that I can black both guys right in the fucking tits. Mm, it's, not, it's not as good a news, but... Oh, he couldn't take that. Mm. Be economical with my energy. You never know. Never know when you might need that one extra. I mean, Dapala's getting blapped anyway. So, if I draw a fifth land, I'm playing Sky Spaceships. If I don't, then we'll just play Pia and Kieran Alar. Mm. Could give this haste. If it, yeah, fuck it. There's a slight chance if I draw a land next turn, I can haste up my Sky Sovereigns. I think that's a risk I'm willing to shit on your mum's tits about. Bup, bup, bubs, magic serenas. 
read in the comments when I watch those streams from other people, not comments on my channel. It looks like a lot of people don't have beta access still. I thought everyone would have had it by now. They look super sad. We're playing Sky Sovereign Battleships. What a load of fucking bollocks. Ah, oh, man. So, there's not a lot I can do about it. He's got his Sky Sovereign before me. That's probably the end of that fucking shit. I'm, I'm not going to play mine, even if I can, because I kill a 1-1. I need, if I can do th a lightning bolt on someone, might as well be useful. That's a shame. That is a shame. Mm, Alright, I'll use the f use of the full mana. Ah, disappointing. Disappointings. So hopefully he plays something with three toughness that's useful to him that I can shoot. Otherwise, I presume I'll take six. He'll black one of these. Or maybe he'll even play a Chandra and I'll be beaten. Nope, no Chandra. Ah, <sighs> fucking hell. Spunk all your balls. <laughs> I'm actually going to have to block it. That's just too big. He gets to scry too. There's no way I can win this now. Oh, well. That's life. How crazy is it that one card can beat a whole deck? <sighs> well, you never know. I've got like a one in a... <laughs> Not a million, but you know. A one in a twenty. So there's no way this is dying. So every turn I'm getting smashed for a lightning bolt and a six to the balls. He got to scry too. There's no point having a fucking blocker. If he can crew it, then he can zap it. So... No need. Pia and Kira Nala will at least have me being able to block. You never know. Let's stay optimistic. We got a one percent. We got a one percenter. That's how horny I get when I see your mom's saggy tits. He didn't crew it. What a greedy biatch. He had a double scry. He didn't make sure he could spaghetti his spaghetti. That's the Dom Jeers. That's the Dom Jeers of being a baby Jeeps. Okay, I'm actually... I really want to play this. Let me see. At the beginning of your upkeep, if you control the artifacts, the hides converted mana cost or tide. Alright, fuck it. Ah, but then I can't actually crew this thing. Hmm. Hmm. You know what? Fuck everyone's balls. If he's got a murder for this, he's got a moida for that. All right, he does have a Moida, maybe. Still, we're fucking going for the risk. We're still risking everyone's ass. Should I have played the Padims? Kept it clean. Oh, he needs some top decks. He needs some tasty tops. Tops tiles. So what? Um, what is my play? It really is Padim, isn't it? I could just flat trade if this is gonna kill me. Don't think it is gonna kill me actually. So I attack with this. Shoot this. Can he race? I don't. I honestly. I don't know. That, I don't, no. You know what? Eat my spaghetti. We're going for it. If he didn't have Moida, he ain't got it now. He still needs three. He didn't pump it. Target artifact gets plus one. 
<sighs> it didn't pop it. Ah, oh, I suppose I can't crew it. That's the problem. Ah, oh, just have to activate this. Yeah, that's what well, that's what has to happen. We've got a crew. We've got to activate my lands. Oh, as he found the murder, he did. He had it the whole time. What a champ. Fucking bitch. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Ah, <sighs> well, that's why you play black. <sighs> that's why you play black. All right, last game, and then this deck's getting deleted. It's getting deleted, ladies and gents, because the key card, the card that's supposed to make it sexies, is a piece of shit. Giriba Ethergrid. Cannot do anywhere near enough. Even if it's part of the... Uh, what do you call it? Throne of the God Pharaoh combo. It doesn't work as... It works worse than... Just the crew. The crewing of a vehicle. Plus, I wish I had black. Those That guy showed me unlicensed disintegration is the weight. Ugh. This is the card. This is why this deck was built. I don't want to take this hand because this card is so shit. Still, what are you gonna do? That's the point of making these videos. To show that Magic Jewels is a load of shit and trying to do something new equals balls. So what's the play on turn three? Ether Severe Harvester and then Padim maybe? Eh, that is sort of the plan. Oops, he's got the he's got all of it. What's the guy's rank? Do I recognize the name? I don't know if I do. So, last game of this shitness. Yeah, I feel like Black. There are, there are too many cards that do the same thing redundantly. Like this. I would take this out for a murder. Is this guy playing five color plainy wanks? It does look like it. Five color plainy cunt shits. We escaped them for a whole hour. I'm not playing against Planes, obviously. That guy can play against the AI. Fucking twat. That deck is so shit that I won't even play it. And I, I, I surprised myself when I asked the audience, shall I play Planes? It was 50-50, which is good enough to say, okay, I will. But I'm not. I just, I just ain't. It's fucking twats. Fucking twats. All right, let's actually do a quick hatchet job in terms of manes and cards that I think are shit. This was the whole point, so I apologize for anyone who was horny for ether grids, but they're shit. <laughs> That's the end of that story. This is probably never getting used. I'll take two of those out. Mm, so what, am I, what do I want to put in black? So black and red and black and blue. Black and blue, black and red. Actually, I only know shits. This can get out. Hmm. All right. Whatever. Uh. What's the rare lands? Black and blue, black and red. Alright, I'll fucking figure this out. So, 29 lands, probably a bit too many. Can't risk doing that anymore. Just chop down the basics. Twenty-five lands and hope for the best. Mm, okay, so we're taking unlicensed disintegrations. Anything else? I don't need you. You're a bitch. 
<laughs> Take a classic. Uh, do I want fatal pushes over harness lightnings now? I don't think. Eh, I think it's all right. All right. So the mana might be a bit all over the place. I got some card draws. We'll see how this works. See, this is just another prime. Maybe it's just me not being able to play. But it's another piece of example of... A piece of example? It's just another example. Not a piece of an example. Of... Just, just, just some things in Magic that can't be done. On Magic Jewels, at least. And I, I'm i just going to extend that to all of Magic. That's why you can't just build any old bollocks you like and take it to FNM and do well. Or even have fun. Because someone's always going to have a better deck than you if you do that. Like, Planeswalkers, I could not... If I played... 100 games against planies with this deck. I'd lose 90 of them. I don't know how that's fun. All right, this guy's going for the super lad man, dog bollocks. Or maybe he's just trying to play commander all by himself. What's his name? Might even Bumbos. Oh, is he fucking playing 100 card mythics? Well, you're allowed to do what you like. So all my lands come into play untapped now, so I'm pleased about that. I think we sorted the manes out. So play a mountain. Wait, if he plays something sexy, oh, it's a fucking planeswalkers again. I think it might be the command. It looks like the commander deck I built for fun earlier, but he's just playing it two players. What a ch what a champ! Yeah. I don't think Harness Lightning's going to be needed. Maybe even Unlicensed Disintegration isn't going to be needed if he's not playing any creatures. And it doesn't look like he is. Two in a row. Two in a row against Planes. Ah, let me think. Am I playing this game? I don't, I don't fucking want to. Well, Eath the Pharaoh shit gives me a 4% chance of winning this stupid game. We'll see. What is people's fucking problems? I want to... Literally, it's true what somebody said in the comments. It's a fucking baby's deck. Fucking shit on a dick. Alright, I understand the system is busy. I'm fucking saying okay, you bitch. Alright, too bad. I don't know what the fuck's gone on. Fuck off. All right, I need Sky Sovereign, probably. All right, good. Take a Moida. What, what, what am I going to be Moida in? I probably need this thing more. All right. <sighs> Hopefully he doesn't have... The emerge card. I can't see that. That's that you, ha that you would have. What a load of old toss. No card. No deck. Could you play a hundred cards of it and still do well? Maybe mono red because it's all the same. That's like the opposite end of the baby spectrum. Number one, play all your cards as fast as possible and attack. Number two, keep sweeping the board until you can sh fucking play. Unbeatable, undealable cards. Ruinous Path. Ruinous Path killed Planeswalkers, didn't they? Doesn't it? Whizbangs didn't allow us to play it because it was too good. But then they allowed every Planeswalker except Dovin Barn the shittest. I don't want to play Planeswalkers, man. This is why Video Editor got bought. So I didn't have to fucking placate these little wankers. Ah. <sighs> So they can black my shit. I don't know what the play is here. I don't give a fuck. That's the problem. <sighs> Alright. I just don't know. I just don't know. If I play anything... It's just going to get shitted on. Uh, let's try this.
So am I going to just waste all of my resources attacking Planes for the next 10 turns before I just give up? <sighs> Mushroom spaghetti. He's gonna. He's got a hundred cards, right? He's gonna have six sweepers by to whenever he wants it somehow. That's how plainy bullshits always work. I don't. I yeah. I shouldn't be playing this game. I shouldn't just be having another game where I'm just moaning. I wanted to phase all of that bollocks out. Well, not out. You know, moaning is sort of my jams. But this is fucking tits on stilts. Uh, I'll move to combat on my turn and attack this for one. If he fucks around, then I'll just Sky Sovereign and kill it anyway. <laughs> what a fucking twat. I'll anguish unmaking a 1-1 one -one Thopter, you fucking tart. Although that is also a bit of a waste of a lightning bolt. So he's got... What? Tezzeret. I can't... I don't want to fucking just keep attacking planies all the time. Still, if he plays the Tezzeret, that's four mana. He'll only have two. I can crew this up. He'll have to have a Blessed Alliance. Or I can... Slap Tezzeret and do six. We'll see. We'll see. Maybe we'll just stand here with our balls in our hand. All right, he's gone. He's gone. Psychos. I think he wants two. Two spaghetti from. Mm, okay. I think he wants two spaghetti from the Tezzeret trigger. I don't need to crew them all, but it does an extra damage. In case you were wondering, ladies and peoples. You see, what a f it is a fucking baby's deck. There's just no magic going on. I'm just kicking his fucking balls. He's trying to flounder around to play all the best cards in the game. Eat my fucking dick. I think I'm going to win no matter what. I'll play Whirler Rogue. Yeah, get the fuck out of the game, you cunt. <sighs> if you're going to do that, you need to just play your mates instead of wasting everyone's time. Piece of shit. All right, one last attempt at a real game with a stupid fucking deck. <laughs> ah, I feel like I've made it a bit better. I'm, I'm taking credit for my own shit. Thopters are balls, and Gear Repair Ether Grid is a fat dick of a bollock. All right, is it vamps? Is it the vamp heroes? If it is, I'm, I'm glad I got. I don't have Gear Repair Ether Grid. I don't know against what kind of a deck I would want that card. But that's the funny thing. That card is quite good. When it first came out, I looked at it and thought, eh, but it might be fun. Maybe this, maybe I'm concentrating too, or maybe, yeah, maybe the deck concentrates too much on actual Thopters as opposed to artifacts. All right. Beep, 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 beeps. Yeah, I'll have to tap that for the colored mana. I don't think that's what I want to do. All right. Well, shit on it. Ugh. I might have to play this on turn three. I might get lucky. No, I did get lucky. So what is... What's the shits? And I got a Sky Sovereign. We all know how dangerous that is. <sighs> Magic Serena. What are we going to do? He fooled me, not playing vamps. Playing elves. That's not an elf. 
Is it? Maybe it is. <laughs> I don't know. All right. Telling tits for lands is the play. Boo, 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 boo. Boo, boo, boo. Baby jeebs. It is elves. Wouldn't have believed it. Unless I saw it. And I did see it because I'm looking at it. Don't forget, ladies and sheeps, we need the subscription bullshits going. So call your auntie, make her make an account in your grandma's name, sign her up to Dr. Bollocks. Mm, I do want that land as well, but good removal is good removals. Uh, what is the play? Well, there's only one. What do you do? Exile an elf card, do a shit. Okay, don't need to kill that just yet. Well, is this getting killed? Yeah, it definitely is. Foiled up elves. Rule number one, well done to you. Fooled me. Although, maybe it is a black elf. I don't know. So, Ether Sphere Harvester, because if I can crew it, which I can, it'll gain me enough life to just negate all his shit. Which is good. That's what you want. You need to be able to negate people's shit. That's what it says at the courthouse. Negate people's shit. So you get punched in the face, tell me about it, I'll negate it. Okay, so three black mana is too much for me to crew this because just two riskies. All right, one is enough. So play Bowmat Courier and Throne of the God Pharaoh. Attack for three. I'll lose. I'll lose too much. Sky, hopefully, I'll draw a land. We'll see. We'll see. I'll play Bowmat Courier for for a red. Maybe I'll just hold Murder and my balls. Mm, Alright, now I've got more blockers than I need. Okay, that should be fine. So the guaranteed three life. I'll block some bullshit and we'll see what happens. Then I can use that as a defensive card f from the next turn. Exile an elf from your grave. This guy gets plus three, plus three. Okay. That might get bigger. Just naturally. You know, in the morning, you naturally get bigger. You think about... You think about Mandy, Mandy murders tits. Naturally get bigs. All right, for this turn, I'm going to block here and I'm going to make him use his spunky shit on it. Then Sky Sovereign, kill that, use one of these as a block. I didn't even fucking try and cheat me. So I'll just block this because it's biggest. Yeah, definitely attack one by one. Even though there's a button right here that says attack with all. We'll do it one by one. Okay, so if I draw a land, the plan is Sky Sovereign, smash this. And then I could just manually block that and challenge him to a murder or a Pompidos. Alright, didn't get my lands. So, play the bones. Mm, it's trying to tap. Trying to tap a black. I need Moida, you fucking bitch. Hmm, do I just attack with this and then murder that? I think I am going to do that. I mean, it is a good defensive card, but... I don't give a fuck. <sighs> I 
Spaghetes, 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 spaghetes. So, block here. If it does the pumps, if it does anything, this is getting murdered. Let's just make it easy on the viewer. Still the same plan. What do you actually do? Whenever this attacks, other people get erections. Alright. Now hold your balls. If I get a mana for Sky Sovereign, I could just blap that and this is in the bag. If not, I'm going to have to just play these two out and shit my ass. Yeah, fuck you. Fuck you, you fucking twit. Trying to play elves. Trying to be... Trying to be varied. Don't be a fucking baby. <laughs> Alright, we'll just take our spaghetti for a turn. Yeah, yeah. Alright, I feel sort of bad. But my deck wasn't exactly turbo potatoes. Anyway. Bringing in black definitely helped. I would have lost that game otherwise. Bottom line... You gotta play every bullshit and then moan. The end. Subscribe. Make a fake account, you cunts.